All right, welcome everybody. I've been gone for a few days, uh, actually close to a little over a week. I had uh, some kidney stones and um, pancreatic issues I had to take care of, but uh, I'm doing pretty good now. And um, back to continue the rest of October. Hopefully we'll get to the goal before the end. We're not too far away. So um, last I was here about a week, Maybe a week and a half ago, I was playing Silent Hill 2. Made it uh, not too far into it, but let's continue into it and see if I can remember what we were. Let's jump on into it. If it's uh, too quiet or too loud, let me know. Let's see. Okay, it looks like we left off in the hospital, I believe. Is this the hospital? Yeah. Right in the front door of the hospital. Okay. Make sure I get all my buttons down. Guessing I should have went to the other side there and unlocked it. Would have made sense. Same door after all, right? Nope. Haven't been back there. The potential for this illness exists in all people, and under the right circumstances, any man or woman would be driven like him to the other side. The other side perhaps may not be the best way to phrase it. After all, there is no wall between here and there. It lies on the borders where reality and unreality intersect. It is a place both close and distant. Some say it isn't even an illness. I cannot agree with them. I'm a doctor, not a philosopher or even a psychiatrist. But sometimes I have to ask myself this question. It's true that to us, his his imaginings are nothing but the inventions of a busy mind but to him there simply is no other reality furthermore he is happy there so why i ask myself why in the name of healing him must we drag him painfully into the world of our own reality something else is written by hand i got the key from joseph it's probably the key to the box i got the purple bull key I didn't mean to do that. <sighs> yeah, it was a pretty wild uh, couple of days there. Definitely wasn't fun going to the VA and getting all that stuff taken care of. get the, into that situation where you start getting closer and closer to 40 and you're not drinking the stuff you should be as often so you start getting kidney stones and it's not fun but I went there for that and found out I had a inflammation in my pancreas which was a little bit scary it turns out that one of the nurses was just assuming that they saw it on my chart and the doctor actually told me that it was just a little bit nothing to worry about just needed to drink some more water i think i'm gonna go downstairs first if i can i didn't think i could That's what I'm 
Here. Where am I at in this place? Probably a bunch of stuff back there that I should have checked out first. Uh, examining room, I guess we'll check that. No, I'll use that. Documents, it looks like. No clues. Looks that was broken. Maybe I could, like, break it. Looks like the lock is broken. I can't open it. Oh, there is the monster. Oh, she got me first. Lapis eye key. Shotgun shells. That <laughs> way, girl. Shit. <laughs> Check this. Just making sure the camera didn't turn me around. Ah, uh, let him do that to me. right there. I'll probably need to use that right now. Yeah, I thought so. I'm pretty close. Didn't think I was really that close to it, but not exactly on easy mode here. That. Where are we going next? Yes, M4. Check it out. the shotgun shells for something more important. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's looking down over there like there's something important. It's not like me over there, though.
looks like there's a bunch of uh, rooms in the darkness that I'll have to get to. It's... Yeah, that's what I thought. I guess I gotta turn the power on, but there's a cover for the elevator's call button. It's locked and I can't get it open. Well, there was rooms on the first floor I didn't explore, but I'll go back to them. Probably should do them now, but whatever. Day room, I better not skip that. Yeah, there's a whole section over here I haven't explored yet. If it'll let me. Whoa! Walk right into that. Good thing I missed. I can see that once we flip over to the darkness, this is going to be a long time into this hospital. Everything is locked. There's something posted on the bulletin board, but it's not really anything of interest. Okay. What about these rooms? Four rooms, kind of random. Let's say I can't, get, I can't get the door open. Huh. Well, this is weird. This is no time to be looking at a stupid poster. Got a chick chick in a bikini. Examination room key. Right in that bloody lab coat. Nice. She just looks like she's bored to death. Alright, checking it out again. Woman's locker room, and then we're going probably upstairs. Pretty sure there's only three floors. Ow! What's wrong? I just pricked myself. Are you okay? Yeah. Bent needle. Ooh, that's fancy. There's a shotgun in the locker. That way. Yeah, that way. What else are they hiding in here? Just randomly find a shotgun in the women's locker room. Now let's see, we probably have to, I can't take that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I checked the elevator and it said I couldn't do anything with it. Yeah, buttons, the elevator doesn't move. Get out the way, I say. Let's make sure he wasn't looking down there. Oh, something not my bad. Whatever it is, it's really close.
get me. Nice. Fuck backwards right on time. Third floor is unusable. I got the bent needle, and I believe that has something to do with what the the roof. I got this whole floor to explore still, so I'm. St Ooh, it's locked. Got like three keys. Yeah. Now you don't want me to go up there. Where am I going? Of course it's locked. Couldn't think it wouldn't switch over and let me through all this stuff until I find the darkness. Get back to the first floor. That's just the part of the area I haven't explored yet. But the rest of the place I've already gotten. And basically the whole first floor. <laughs> Take a left and go into the visiting room. And that's not happening. Nope. Nope. There weren't any doors over here, were there? Animation room. Here we go. There's nothing important in this room, so why did I need it? What's this file? Lab results from a personality disorder test. Lab results, I don't want to read this. Well. Is that shotgun shells? Yep. Food only. Do not store drugs. Oh, she likes to stand in my way. Third floor patient wing hall, 7335. I have to remember that when I go up there again. I guess whenever it flips over. Taking kind of a random backdoor area through this. But hey, it knocked out pretty much the whole upper quarter. Uh, that was the wrong door. Seriously? That's, I thought that was the back door, but I guess not. Now it's unlocked. Alright. How did I miss that door? Well, it's an elevator. Geez, how many broken doors are there? Cafeteria's blocked up. Floors inaccessible. Yeah, it says, uh, yeah, all this stuff up here. Oh, well, it's all good. 
So we're going to go... Turn around, I think. Yes. Like that in the cell line. I thought I unlocked that. Hmm. This is going to be a little interesting. Let me check these keys and see if there's anything I'm not, like, I haven't checked. Wow, I didn't think it. Okay, I got that. Lapis side key, and I, let's check this out. I caught from the top of the key, the iris part is made of a lapis lazuli. Nothing special about it. Look at this. Looks like I can't use that. I didn't mean to use it. I just wanted to. Oh, I can't do shit, but I have to combine it with something. Ah, I'm just trying. <laughs> Anything. <coughs> All right. Come to a bit of a challenge here because I'm missing something somewhere. There's got to be something in the second floor because there's a lot going on. This was the examination. I believe I got the key from this room. There's a typewriter here. I've gotten a use for it. What's a, wait a minute, what's this? There's a sheet of carbon paper still stuck in the typewriter. I can still read the imprint left on it. I know it. I know the number of the box. 9598. It can't help him anymore. The button key doesn't scare me so nobody can stop who I am. I don't know who I am is who I am is who I am is. This is not five nine eight. <laughs> There's a couple of typewriters that I wasn't <laughs> even able to look at because of her. She was standing in front of stuff. The lock is broken, I can't open it. This could be a padlock. <coughs> Please move. That's where I got the lapis key, I believe. This ain't the same room. There's no way. It is the same room. I thought I went up the hallway. Didn't turn around. Yeah, the 
that's probably what he was staring at before. Okay. That was one buddy was staring at in that room. I have to go back outside. Seeing unless there's like a no. Mm -hmm. None of these doors are accessible. I have fun killing everything. Only I can get to the basement and turn this stuff on. No, there's a generator down there. Yeah, this is where I found all that stuff. Tell if she was blocking a good locker for me or not. Guess there's nothing else left in here. I already checked the lab coat. Go back up to the third floor because I see a couple locked doors and maybe that key will do something. He's got to do something. I don't think I would need to take it, I don't know, to like... I guess I was just being hopeful that it might work on the roof. Maybe it won't make me forced to use it. Hmm. <laughs> just looking for blue eyes carved I'm sure I've seen a clue of that before but it uh, it's been about a couple weeks so I'm just playing this off of a uh, brush of where I left off trouble. Wow. I'm wasting a lot of heals on these things. Maybe there's like a notepad, like a key lock, because I've been seeing a lot of numbers. I 
here's one. So which one is it? Is it nine five nine eight? Let's try that one first. Nine five nine. Did I hit eight? Um, what was the other one? I remember that being on a type. Nine five nine eight was one, and then there was like a seven five five something. I can't remember what that one was. Seven five five three, I guess. No. I ran into a couple different codes, so I'm trying to remember which one is which. So it must be the uh, 755 whatever, 7558, maybe? No? Can't remember that code. I don't think Let's pick a random number. It has to be seven five five something. Cause I think that nine eight nine five or whatever that one was was a something about a box. Let's see. Nine, eight, nine, maybe. I could have sworn it was nine, eight, nine, five or something like that. But this saying it's not right. Hmm. I really don't want to go back and look. Yeah, I'm looking it up because I've, I've seen the code somewhere, but I can't remember because my memory is just really bad. I've got a really bad memory. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, I see what I did. That's my fault. See, I read it as I got all dyslexic and read it backwards. So I was saying 7553, but it's actually 7335. That's my fault. No wonder I was not getting it right. Yeah, I know I ran past it on a board somewhere, and it told me 
that it was a key to the door upstairs, but yeah, that was my fault. Should have read it one more time to try and make sure I wasn't kidding myself and I ran for a bunch of numbers in my head. These girls like to bust people up. Just a hangover. You should rest. Mm. <laughs> so comfy. She's high as a kite. I'm gonna go look for her. For Laura. I'll be back as soon as I can. Let's see. I actually got the roof key now. Yay. I knew that was going to pop up somewhere. Good direction to fight these things. Mm, right in the face. Checking to see if that chick didn't like completely wreck me when she hit me with that. Aha! This is the whole hook, Ben Hook thing. But I need like a thread or something. There's something stuck in the drainage pipe. The hole is too small. I can't get my hand inside to reach it. Maybe if I had a long, narrow tool of some kind. It isn't long enough. Yeah, that's why you need, like, a string or hair or something. Anyway, which way do we want to go? Got the store and turn to the character's right. There's a cover over the elevator, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Breaking it all. Now I turn the hammer to make it really hard on myself. Up. 
Anybody in here want to mess with me? Ah, uh, that's right. This puzzle. Louise, I'll take care of your four ever. I'll take care of you four ever. It's my destiny. There's one of these that's like a nine eight. Okay, nine, what was it like nine eight nine five or nine five nine eight something like that? Nine. Let's see if it's this one. Eight nine five. Nope. I do know. Maybe I can use this on that. There we go. Let's try nine five nine eight. There we go. Now I just need one more. Don't know that one yet, but I will find it. All right, looks like the plan is to go to the roof now since I got the roof key and I've used everything else. Oh no! I knew that was gonna happen as soon as I miss and try to swim again. They did that much damage to me. Yeah. Yep, yep. The stairs is right here. Okay. Up the steps we go. Wonder what's going to happen up in this skiffy ass place. Uh, they're just waiting to just drop something on me. Place is too big of an area for there not to be a fight. There's something on the floor. Is this a diary? May 9th. Rain. Stared out the window all day. Peaceful here. Nothing to do. Still not allowed to go outside. May 10th. Still raining. Talked with the doctor a little. Would they have saved me if I didn't have a family to feed? I know I'm pathetic. Weak. Not everyone can be strong. May 11th. Rain again. The meds made me feel sick today. If I'm only better when I'm drugged, then who am I? Who am I anyway? May 12th. Rain as usual. I don't want to cause any more trouble for anyone, but I'm a bother either way. Can it really be such a sin to run instead of fight? Some people may say so, but they don't have to live in my shoes. It may be selfish, but it's what I want. It's too hard like this. It's just too hard. May 11th. It's clear outside. The doctors told me I've been released, that I've, been, that I've got to go home. I... The diary ends here. There are no more entries. What was the diary doing up here? I don't know, but... There's obviously something that I do up here. <laughs> oh, dog. I wasn't expecting that.
He's so mad from me whooping his ass last time. Hey, Dak. He backdoored me into the special treatment room. Yeah, let's have mobs. Broke door. Broke door. Did I say anything? If Joseph looks calm, he can be taken out of his cell. Joseph's cell. A padded room. He's not here. Something written on the wall. There's the other code. Two, four, two, one, it looks like. Turn, turn, turn the numbers. Better not forget them, so I'll write them down here. The other one, my secret name. See, I read it, and then I forget what the numbers are. Like, oh, better not forget. It's like, I already did. Two, four, two, one. It's an S14 I need to go to. All these dead bodies laying everywhere. There it is. Two, four, two, one. So I'm guessing it just needs a key. That's where I need that, uh, what was it? The string to get out of that drain. Maybe I can get it from her. easy to just pull a hair out of her head and then just tie it to the hook and pull it out that way. But that's too easy. S3. Shower room is where that last key is going to be. Check. <coughs> I'll be okay soon. <coughs> Did you find Laura? <coughs> James, I want to ask you something. What if... What if you can't find Mary? What will you do? I haven't thought about that. I'll be okay soon. <coughs> Did you find Laura? Okay, that's all she's gonna say. Um, they're really gonna make me go out of way for this. <sighs> that is a pain. Especially since there's nowhere else to go besides up. Maybe if I go up to the back upstairs and to the roof, 
You're like, hey, dickhead, what do you think you're doing? Why are you knocking me off the roof for? If he's still there. He's not still here. He knocked me off here. Very, very weird. May have to trigger something by going like down to the first floor or something. I don't know. Hoping maybe there'd be something lying up here that I could use. I don't see anything anywhere. They just wanted to let that dude knock me down. I'm going to go downstairs and see if I don't like trigger something different to happen. Back to the first floor. Trigger something down here, but I don't see anything. Not one thing I could have missed. That kitchen is blocked. The whole left side of the first floor is inaccessible. drawn on it in purple. It was on the desk and it died. Honestly couldn't tell you what that's for. It's probably something important. But maybe there was something interesting over here. Mm -mm. Mm 
Yeah, that's the other typewriter. But it didn't say anything important. I got the key from Joseph. It's probably the key to that box. Oh. Interesting. Really? That was on me. I didn't pay close enough attention to what that description said, but now I understand it. I need to go up to the third floor to room S14. And use this purple bull key on uh, that box. Because I had the key all along. I just didn't read it. Well, actually, I did read it. The description's not on the key. It's on um where I found the key. By that typewriter in that back room. Success. Alright, S14, where you at? Come from the stairs right there, so this is back into the medical facilities, this room, S14 is at the end of the hall. Okay. Alright. Here we go. There's the string that I need. A few hairs inside. Look at that. How wonderful everything just kind of fits together. <laughs> Combine type. It's not letting me exactly combine anything, you know? Yeah. I guess I'll have to go to the room first and do it. It's just down this way. Shower room. Which room is the shower room? First door on my left, past this little hallway. Right here. Oops, wrong button. There we go. Elevator key. Well, I got access to that damn thing. Right behind me. Alright. So I guess I'm going to the first floor because that's the side I don't have access to. little garden play area looks like a door to the basement can't go in there sounds like dark Vader's breathing in my ear Interesting. Yeah, bullets. Looking over 
here too, aren't you? What's over here? Shotgun shells. Where it came from. Looks like we have a lot to go through. Now, how the hell she get in here? Tell me. You gonna yell at me if I don't? No, I won't. I was friends with Mary. We met at the hospital. It was last year. You liar! Laura, I... Fine, don't believe me. Last year, Mary was already... I'm sorry, Laura. Anyway, let's go. We can talk about this later. This is no place for a kid. There are all sorts of strange things around here. I can't believe you haven't even got... Later, okay? But it's really important. What is it? A letter from Mary. Huh? I want to go get it. Is that okay? Yes. Yes. Gullible, dude. What are you doing, Laura? It's further back in the desk. Laura! What are you doing? Oh, this is gonna be fun. Ha ha! I tricked you. Open the door, Laura. Why should I? I'm a liar, right? Want me to open it? Huh? Huh? Do ya? What's the magic word? Laura? Okay. I guess it won't open it. I think I'll just leave you like this. You snotty little brat! Open up! <laughs> Why, you... you... Laura? Yeah, it's time to work out the good toys.
This just goes wild. Oh, I'm not hurt. That's kind of a shock considering that thing grabbed me twice. Anything in this room? I think after all that, they reward me with something. Anyway, let's get that pipe back equipped. I'm gonna beat that little girl with this stick when I find her. There's a room to my right, but yeah, I figured it'd be great. I probably ex explored all these rooms before. There was no way I would have known, but now I'm in the darkness and it's gonna get replay of the hospital all over again. Coming at me since I walked in the door. I need a lot of handgun bullets, but I don't really use them. Examining room two. Please. 
so this whole area is shot. Thanks, King Satan. I got a bunch of new games in uh, the mail today, too. Let's see. We're going to go to, I guess, the only place I can, the elevator. to the second. about dead now. Yep, no health left. Jeez, shouldn't have had that much trouble with these things. Where it is valuable stuff. Why not? If it kills me, it kills me. <laughs> it's no good. The door is too heavy to open by myself. It looks like an old refrigerator. I don't see how it's too heavy. Room. I'm gonna, um, since there's other stuff to go on that side, you gotta be kidding me. Are they all alive again?
hit me while I'm by these things. I got the dry cell battery. Got the basement storeroom key. Part of the wallpaper is torn. I can see something drawn on the wall beneath. Are those hands searching for something? Or are they just a sign of pain? There's a piece of paper on the bed. I was locked up inside the basement's basement. It was so small and dark and I was so afraid. I dropped my precious ring, but I will never ever go back there. That's pretty, uh... A basement's basement. Gotta be in like severe pain. Yeah, my dude's not even close to being healed yet. He's still a little bit red, even after using a first aid kit. Another door over here. This one. That's what I said. That's a weird map. The map, I, I get it. The map is distorted because we're in the darkness, so we can't really navigate it the same. I'm stuck on the. Yeah, I'm stuck on the far left side of everything. All I can do is just keep on going up. more of that punishment. There's gonna be these guys in every single room up here. Uh, so it's gonna be bad. Are there any like safe rooms it looks like? Tell him he's gonna take much chances and start running through doors. Maria's not here. Where could she have gone? Her empty medicine bottles will here. Is that is this what Maria was taking? Okay. 
just checking my possibilities out here. Oh, he's not gonna let me come out here. This is gonna be a little different. I'm a dad. I have to do all this over again. Uh, that's a shame. I just have to be more careful with all these things now. There's too many of them just to mess with them. Especially when there's like three or four in a room. Just trying to kill everything. Might as well just run past. Check all the rooms, make sure I got everything. <laughs> some heels and just move, move, move. No messing around. That's not fair. She can recover and swim. trying to spam the attack as soon as I walk in the rooms like that. Come on, pick it up. There you go. Yeah, he already took some damage just from that one hit. So I don't have to do all that garbage again. Since there's like an ungodly amount of people in this a whole entire hospital. Second floor. I try to walk forward to try to get up to that spam. It doesn't happen. No, I've got what? One heal and two of those. 
just use that. That's force. Come on. Gotta keep this girl to death before she'll go down. I didn't get hit that many times at a time. But it is definitely going to be tough trying to get my heels back. I know there's multiple people in here that can see me anyway. It doesn't matter. Use it all. I don't know how many times I got hit in that room. Anyway, I need to stop using that button. Rip it out of my controller, so I stop using it. M5. Basically full health now and got that heal. Talking about a ring in the basement's basement. Got the stuff I needed there. Cool. Let's go all the way down the hall to M1. Sure, examining room three is broke too. This room's got this coffin style refrigerator. So we're going to go up, I guess, around this. Can I go in here? Nope. Third floor is where it gets crazy. <laughs> Got to be ready to fight as soon as I get up here. Still coming. It's not around me. Searching the doors. Okay. Got our empty medicine bottles here. Is this what Maria was taking? Is Maria sick now too? I 
guess we'll check uh, across the hall and then S2 and S1. Guys really get a lot of stamina. I'm gonna wait until it gets like dark red before I'll use that. Ah, S8. It's not gonna exactly tell me which one S8 is. Scrap of paper on the ground. Just some doodle. Huh, something is written on it. She is an angel no one knows, only I can see the lady at the door. They cannot walk along her bridge of thread, they fall from the weight of their crimes. Like bloated and ugly corpses, their sin she devours them, sin and sinner alike. She says to me she is an angel. Ampule. Next door, S12. Wonder if S14 is available in this room. Nope. S14 had that lockbox. Not anymore. I'm guessing that whole uh, paper was talking about this. A safe place. Some too. Oh, I think there's double attacks. I never can really test them out. I'm probably going to need that heal now. Yeah. I found another. Here, 
check this little area out. Is the elevator accessible? Not this one. It's all blocked off too, so I guess we're going to probably the roof. Because there's only two actual areas I really haven't explored yet, and that's the roof. Well, let's pull about half the hospital. Let's say that. Since I'm on the third floor, let's go up to the roof and see what's going on. no access to the roof, no point to go up there. So third floor is done from this point. Oh, can't go through the second floor area this way. That sounds a little out there. We're going to the basement. Is that like a squealing dead rat? A rat dying, or is that like a? Jeez. Okay, they're giving me an awful lot of shotgun shells. James! Mary? Oh, Maria. It's you. I thought you were... Sorry. Anyway, I'm glad you're alive. Anyway? What do you mean, anyway? You don't sound very happy to see me. I was almost killed back there. Why didn't you try to save me? All you care about is that dead wife of yours. I've never been so scared in my whole life. You couldn't care less about me, could you? No, I just... Then stay with me. Don't ever leave me alone. You're supposed to take care of me. Girl, I don't even know you. <laughs> so, what about Laura? Did you find her? Yeah, but she ran away. We've got to find her. You really seem to care about her. Do you know her? I've never met her before. I just feel sorry for her. She's all alone. And for some reason, I feel like it's up to me to protect her. The basement's basement. They dropped a ring down here, they said. And there's that ring. A copper ring. I got a feeling I should probably examine it, because... What am I going to read? Like, some kind of special spell or something? I found in the basement of the hospital it's engraved with a picture of a spider. Oh yeah, that's a pleasant sound.
wonder if this ring goes inside that uh, door on the third floor. It might go into that. I can't go in there from this side, so it doesn't matter. I just gotta go to the third floor. Third floor we go. Now I'm just trying to remember, oh yeah, that's right, down this way I believe, no, yes, okay, my ankle's getting a little sketchy. There's a painting of a woman on the door. Oddly enough, the hand part of the painting is actually in 3D and sticks out. Yeah. I put the copper ring on the hand of the lady in the painting. thought that that would have done something more, but whatever. <laughs> oh, okay, I got her with me now, so hey chick, come on. It makes sense that I could go take the elevator to uh, the second floor and have her help me open up that That's what I'm doing. Hi there, everybody! Thanks for tuning in! Welcome to another exciting edition of Trick or Treat! Here you either answer the questions correctly and win a great prize, or fail to answer correctly and receive the punishment. It all depends on you! And our lucky, or should I say, unlucky challenger today is James! James Sunderland! Are you ready to play Trick or Treat? Okay, here's your first question. Okay. Merry-go-round, potted house, roller coaster, Ferris wheel, and teacups. Silent Hill is home to a thrilling amusement park that both children and adults love. The question is, what is the name of this amusement park? One, Fantasyland. Two, Silent Hill Amusement Park. Three, Lakeside Amusement Park. Okay, quickly, on to question number two. Silent Hill witnessed a gruesome murder a few years back. A brother and sister were playing in the road when they were attacked and chopped into pieces with an axe. Torn flesh. Smashed bones, spattered blood, and finally... What a terrible tragedy! What a gruesome end to such innocent lives! Now, the question. What was the name of the murderer who committed this vile act? One, Walter Sullivan. Two, Scott Fairbanks. Three, Eric Guy. Now, for our third and final question. South of the lake is a deserted old neighborhood called South Bay. There to Paleville, the central resort area northwest of the lake, there's only one road you can take. Just one road. No more. The third and final question is... What is the name of that road? One, Buckman Road. Two, Rendell Street. Three, Nathan Avenue. 
Well, that's the last of our questions. Have you got it all figured out? When you know the answers, head to the storeroom on the third floor to collect your prizes. But be careful. If you're wrong... <laughs> well then, everybody, thanks for tuning in. See you again sometime. Bye-bye. That was fun. <laughs> what was that? Okay. Always turning the wrong way. open it? Yeah. Maria, give me a hand here. Come on. You're supposed to be the big man around here. How's a little girl like me supposed to help? <clears throat> What's this? Not very cute, is it? Here, James. You take it. Mm, thanks. A lead ring. Yay. Not that one. I guess now we're going back upstairs, put the lead ring on her, and the storeroom. We got the Lakeside Amusement Park, we got the Bachman Road, it's the only road that leads out, and then, um, the murderer name, I can't remember that one. Is it a storeroom? Yeah, okay, there's the storeroom. Well, you know. ring on the hand of the lady in the thing. Now it's open. But hey, let's go check out the whole storeroom stupid thing. I must save it just in case things go a little... Just in case I'm wrong. Uh, because I'm... I know two out of the three for sure. Where's the storeroom at, though? Right next to me. Right next to me. Question one was three, I believe. Question three was Bachman Road, and I think that was the first option they gave me. I'm not sure about this one. Yeah. Maybe. Push the buttons when nothing happened. know what happens. I need to repeat that. Uh, let's reload that. I'm not gonna let myself get hurt because of something stupid. Uh, I 
King quit out? Come on now. <laughs> I just want to reload. Um... Yeah. What I'm going to do, I'm just going to reload and try that again because I'm the save room's right next to the prize box. It's probably 331. It's not 321. It might be 311. Uh, but yeah. Let's go ahead and. Um, Let's go ahead and uh, reload that. Just take a second. It's, it's not three, two, one, so it has to be three, one, one, because I know the first question was answer three, which is Lakeside Amusement Park. Taking a little second to load up this time. I always have trouble with this. I might have to reload it again. Yeah. Let's try it all over again. It's usually when I don't let the trophies catch up and install. It's hard to tell when it does though. It doesn't exactly uh, catch up to the loading screen. It takes forever. All right, we got it. I just had to be patient and let it load up a little bit longer this time. Let's get back in there. Yeah, it took a little longer than I expected to mess around with this, but we're here. That'd be maybe three one one, I would say. Come on, what could else what else could it be? Three three one? I know for certain that it's Bachman Road and Lakeside Amusement Park as two out of the three questions. Maybe that is, that is just a trap. Who knows? Now I'm just gonna try it again.
The only other thing I could that it has to be is three three one. Can't be anything else. Imaginarily settle in. I don't know why they have to install every time I turn this one on. Let's see what direction it goes. There we go, this should work. Got it. Okay. If it don't work this time, then it's a it's a trap box and not meant to be opened because I've already tried it with every uh I know the question three and question one that are right it's question two that was giving me a problem because I didn't know I didn't I don't know the names of these murderers so if this ain't right not this yeah it's a, a trap box. It's a joke. It's not meant to be open. So yeah. I'm just gonna go ahead and just keep it on this screen and just let it load up. So you know what I'm talking about. I have to wait a couple seconds for it to catch up. If I try to jump in and start a game too soon, then it'll just show a white screen. playing this game right here okay so that's a joke room so I'm not gonna worry about it anymore I'm just gonna if I can put in all the answers and they still not be right it's just they're just screwing with me Let's just check that to make sure, because I'm tired of messing with it. It's going to end up bugging on me. Okay, that's... Really, Nathan Street? Him talking about Bachman Road being the only way to get to, uh... Lakeside Amusement Park from, uh... On, um... What was it? Silent Hill 1. Now all of a sudden they changed the streets' names. 
No wonder I couldn't figure out this uh, puzzle box. Screwing with my head, jeez. Yeah. I could have sworn it was Bachman Road. They made a big deal about that being the only road in and out of, uh. I don't know if it was the way in and out of, um, Saw Hill itself, or if it was the only way in and out to, uh, Lakeside, parts of the lake, toward uh, Lakeside Amusement Park. It was one or the other, I know that. Hey, Chaos, yeah, I'm doing alright. I was actually um, off for almost a week, a little over a week. Um, I had to take last weekend off and a little bit into uh the beginning of this week and catching up because i had kidney stones and i was you know bleeding out of it and i went to the hospital at the va and i was only going there for antibiotics and stuff like that because i was trying to pass kidney stones because i was in a lot of pain and everything i thought i had a kidney infection and stuff and it turned out that uh they were saying i had a slight um pancreatic uh, inflation too so i had to stop eating and stop drinking and you know flush out my system for a couple days on top of that so i had to cool down and not sit in this chair so much because you know the pain in the back when you have kidney stones is excruciating there's a note on the back on the ground Inside is some kind of hard to read writing. I took the director's key, the one to the museum. I hid it behind the praying woman when I went out the day trip. I picked it up, but I did not steal it. I'm not a criminal. This is going down further than I would have thought. Wow. What is this gonna be like the boss room boss man of the hospital? Yo, you better run, chick. He ain't messing with you. Come on, girl. Why are you hanging out with him? She's just casually walking. Are you for real. Thanks, Chaos. It was, uh, it was a little scary to hear that my pancreas was, uh, a little inflamed, but that was just, it was just a little inflamed. They made it sound worse than it was because they told me it was, uh, just inflamed to begin with until later that night at the VA. The doctor actually said, it's just a little bit and I just need a little bit of flushing out and stuff to clean it all out. But yeah, it was just more pain than anything. But yeah, thanks for the, uh... Thanks for the support, buddy. I only have 
to not have to drag that dead meat around anymore. No more carrying her around. It's all good, man. Um, oh, my back. It took about maybe a week to about a week to about ten days, maybe seven to, t seven to ten days before it completely flushed out and the pain went completely away. But they gave me some like painkillers and stuff, and I didn't take them because they get a little uh, heavy on giving painkillers out at the VA. Not about that life. anything of importance because everything's locked. But yeah, I just wanted to get good as soon as possible and just uh, get back to streaming so people didn't think that I, uh, you know, just up and dipped. So I do enjoy doing it. You know, I just didn't think I was going to be gone as long as I was. Is everything locked? not bold enough to be stared at from across the abyss is not bold enough to stare into itself. The truth can only be learned by marching forward. Follow the map. There's a letter and a wrench. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, just, you know, tough life stuff, but we all get over it. I'm just glad it's over now. You just sat and watched Laura walk by like it was no big deal. She's a little monster. and every other room is locked because that hospital lobby key was the only thing that was really important. Yep. That was it. Time to get out of here. Finished. Finally finished up the hospital. dead. Once again, I couldn't do anything to help. Laura has run off somewhere. Mary, what, what should I do? Are you really waiting somewhere for me? 
Or is this your way of taking... I'm going to find Mary. It's the only thing I have left to hope for. Alright. I'm guessing the first thing they don't want me to do is go to the so-called, uh... What was it? Rock, Rosewater Park, Historicals. That's all the stuff I've already done. Guess I'm going to Silent Hill Historical Society. Up this way, right? Stuff just lying around. People to use. The street's blocked off, right? I gotta get across Heaven's Night. Oh, what? Can't go back the way I came. That's dumb. I can't go back the way I came. That's the hospital. I'm not going back in there for no reason. They're gonna make me circle around months and go down here, get this stuff, and we'll get do it. my time on. How far up the street are we? Halfway? This ran into somebody's yard. Rifle shells. in somewhere. the right way because these nurses are all over the street. Why would they block us off and have so much protection?
things like this in here, but they don't do anything for you. Memo line on the sofa. I'll wait at Bar Neely's. I already did all that, didn't I? Gonzales Mexican restaurant. Whoa. It didn't look like it was crucified up against something, and then I got close to it and it started moving. Nurses definitely got a pretty good way away from the hospital. <laughs> Is that a way for you at Bar Neely's? Now, I think I remember seeing that letter before, but I don't know if I've ever been there. This is Barney Ellis.
you really want to see Mary, you should just die. But you might be heading to a different place than Mary James. There was a hole here. It's gone now. There you go. I went to the bar and I said some messed up stuff. How far down do you gotta go? To the corner? Perhaps you are a fool. The truth usually betrays people. A part of that abyss is in the old society. The key to the society is in the park, at the foot of the praying woman, inside of the grounds, inside of a box. To open it, I need a wrench. A patient buried it there. I knew, but did nothing. It made me uneasy to have such a thing near. I wasn't looking for the truth, I was looking for tranquility. I also saw that thing. I fled, but the museum was sealed as well. Now no one dares to approach that place. If you still do not wish to stop, James, I pray to the Lord to have mercy on your eternal soul. Guess I'm getting close to the end. Closer. Got the wrench. Left up this way. I was gonna know they'll let me through up here. It's something about a box in a park. Park, Rosewater Park. I was like, that's where I'm going. Do you not think I'd go up that way? Nope. I'm gonna keep on going straight. Should be able to get to the park up that way. Which is on heavy prowl tonight. Mm. 
not just but extreme darkness. Shotgun shells I can get. Is that something about a hole in a box on a down? Obvious, I just gotta find it. <sighs> that gray square back there. <sighs> Here we go, at the foot of the statue. For this statue. <sighs> Victim of persecution by somebody. Jenny Carroll, I guess that's what I was going to say because I blocked it out. Lived with pride and honor. What happened here shall never be forgotten. Really? Okay, that's what I was looking for. Could there be something under here? Yeah. Ah. A small metal box is fastened by bolts. I can't open the lid. Yeah, you can. Old bronze key. Guessing that'll get me into the historical society. Big giant circle around, got the bronze key, and we're going to the historical society. Up the road. Man, he gets tired, so he has to slow down, take a breath. Uh, 
That's rough, too. Oh, I saw something in the ground. That's a jog. I get to the historical society. I gotta be getting close by now. Yeah, I'm right next to it. That was a haul. This broke. Someone stole something here. And it crashed through the wall and ran down the stairs. I bet that was Big Man. There's a photo of a deep, deep hole. What could this be? Photo of the director of the old Brookhaven Hospital. It looks like he was a famous person in town. Photo is hanging here. Brookhaven Hospital, 1880. Nobody made it. This hospital was built in response to a great plague that followed a wave of immigration to this area. It was originally little more than a shack, but it gradually grew and grew. There's nothing particularly special about this photograph. Nothing useful written on them. Oh yeah, going underground. Going way underground. Jeez, how many f steps are there? Uh, is it supposed to be like this? Am I supposed to run down an infinite number of steps? Yeah, I was about to say, geez, what was taking so long? Sounds like there's somebody on my ass, too. I have a document is lying here. September 11th, 1820. Prisoner number C221. I can't read the rest. What is this? Give me a first aid kit so they're planning on me uh, facing some heat. Giant hole in the middle, you jump down. <laughs> I'm gonna explore this area. There's more stuff that's useful for me to grab. I'd like to grab it. Those hanging here. Crimson and white banquet for the gods. Photos hanging here. Death by skewering. 
execution at the prison, death by skewering or strangling, to choose his death as the prisoner's last taste of freedom. A photo is hanging at the Luca Prison Camp. Built during the Civil War, later became Toluca Prison. Gotta jump down the hole because there's nowhere else to go. You scared, I know. Nowhere else to go, though. This prisoner C 221's uh, cell, right? Big old well full of water. Just a wall, it would be impossible to climb this. Okay. This area. I'm just trapped inside a damn well. Is this like it? Like you're stuck? There's nothing else you can do? not cool. What am I supposed to do while I'm stuck down here? Hmm. Gotta be something I'm missing. Did not mean to waste a show. Uh. Uh. I'm not seeing any hint to this well. He's not looking around to see anything to pick up. I didn't just like get myself stuck, did I? This is what I was doing. I already knew I was doing that. 
problem is I've been searching the wall looking for something different because I know that's what you gotta do. This is different. Just this spot here feels different than the normal wall. I wonder if I could somehow break it. switch but nothing happens. Holy shit. This area is messing with me. Is that which led it be to purgatory? So concentrate on the damn bugs so you won't I have no clue what this could possibly be. Uh, 
because the answer was just um you have to find the random code for those three numbers I guess. I don't know. Figured it out. I saw three uh, numbers lit up, but what the... there's a door at the bottom. The door is locked. Um, but I there we go. Spiral writing key. It's pitch black beyond the door. I can't tell how far the blackness stretches. I gotta go down. I mean, just going down and down, further and further. Eddie's fat ass? Yes, it is. How the hell do you get here? Killing a person ain't no big deal. Just put the gun to their head. Pow. You, you killed him? But, but, but it wasn't my fault. He, he made me do it. Calm down, Eddie. Tell me what happened. That guy, he, he had it coming. I didn't do anything. He just came after me. Besides, he was making fun of me with his eyes, like that other one. Just for that, you killed him? What do you mean, just for that? Eddie, you can't just kill someone because of the way they looked at you. Oh yeah? Why not? Till now, I always let people walk all over me. Just like that stupid dog. He had it coming too. Eddie? <laughs> I was just joking, James. He was dead when I got here. Honest. Anyway, I gotta run. You're going out there alone? Yeah. Eddie? He got here alone. It's a corpse. The body is marked with bullet holes. Yeah. I was sworn there was a he's sitting there on the ground too. But oh well. Looks like a perfect place for Eddie's fat ass to be. Considering it's a uh kitchen. Got the tablet of gluttonous pig. Mm, yeah, there's a couple of important things to grab. I might as well just. Yeah, and continue, I guess. Prison cafeteria. How deep in the ground are we for here? Documents on the desk that got nothing to do with me, though.
Anchor the door. Anchor the door. It's a little bigger than I thought it was. They massacred this place. Stomped right through to the other side. Where the visitors, I guess, are supposed to be. A lighter in this other room. Go ahead and get it. up the whole way to the top way figures oh yeah I gotta love the bathrooms in this game something always come from the bathrooms in these games. I knock on the door, but there's no answer. Okay, so won't you? All right. Then you down the hall. Anything important in the bathroom that I can pick up before I save? Alright, um, before it gets too much later, I'm going to, uh, call it for this part of the stream on um retro i mean not retro i'm sorry for my um silent hill stream because i'm going to do retro here in about an hour at about 10 o'clock in about an hour we'll pop something down because i've been getting a lot of new games recently so if people want me to play some um spooktober uh theme games i can do that but i've got a ton of stuff to choose from uh, so, give me some time to um, use restroom and 
get something to eat and you know chill off get me a smoke and everything get a drink i'll be back in about an hour to entertain everybody with some uh maybe some nintendo or genesis or super nintendo something like that but it will be retro late night starting again tonight at 10 o'clock eastern time i hope everybody had fun while you're here watching the silent hill uh stream and drop me a follow come back in about an hour we'll be here for retro have a good night and i hope you'll come back Oh god, I'm doing that stuff again.